We featured the Leesburg Partnership in a previous episode, and we learned how all of the events that they put on throughout the year raise an enormous amount of money that not only impacts the economy in a positive way, but also helps local charities. Although they're busy organizing over 200 events throughout the year, they're also very focused on recruiting and retaining local businesses. And in 2014, an effort to develop a high-profile gateway to Main Street could be the next step to the ongoing commitment to improving this vital slice of Leesburg. The partnership does a lot to encourage uh, business development and, and incentive programs, and we serve as the advisory board for the downtown CRA, and in that role, what we try to do is, is let the city know where business leaders think they should be spending money creating incentives. I think it's important for people to know that the partnership is for all of Leesburg. We're not just downtown. Uh, the Economic Restructuring Committee has people that, with businesses downtown, people with businesses on 27, uh, all over town, and we're really just trying to make the whole city of Leesburg a better place. Of course, a vibrant downtown helps businesses everywhere, so that gets a lot of focus. A community is measured by the health of their downtown first. You go to any community in the country and you see a dilapidated downtown area, you're going to see it all throughout the community and communities across the country are working on revitalizing their core, their heart of their community before they work out into the other areas. You know, downtown is the home to the library, the police department, the city hall, social security office, the veterans clinic, and many service entities, churches, and businesses that are the community. The Gateway Project for the City of Leesburg and the partnership is an entryway into the city. A lot of times people, when they come into Leesburg, they really don't know that they've come into Leesburg. So the entryway is going to be at the corner of Main Street and 27. It is going to have some arches, some, a really just nice feature to say this is coming into the downtown. Well, the Gateway Project that the city and the partnership are involved in right now, I feel that if they build it, they will come. Um, it will point them to downtown and let them know that we are attempting to beautify our city and to let them know what a great downtown area we do have and what we have to offer. Making ourselves look good certainly brings, uh, you know, people to town. We're hoping that, you know, will impact our schools, uh, which certainly impacts the future of our community. But getting here is often the problem, bringing those people off of Highway 27 and further into downtown, which is just a few blocks but we need to make it more attractive. We need to make it so that people will want to come and go, ooh, what is that? And I'm really looking forward to this project. It's been years in the planning. It hasn't been rushed. It has been well thought out, well planned. I'm very excited about the gateway and the things that the partnership are working on. This group works well together. I can't imagine how any small town is going to compete with us next year. Impossible. Downtown Sanford is being used as a model for what Leesburg aspires to look like as the phases of the Gateway Project roll out. There's still a great deal of work to be done, but the Leesburg Partnership hopes to break ground on the new Gateway during the summer of 2014. We'll keep you updated.